Where have you been all my life, honey? I've been in my A, I know. I'm so sorry, but I'm back for you guys for now. Stay tuned for the haul if you want to see what I've been collecting. Mwah. Hi, guys. So, I've been gone on a hiatus. I know. And I'm kind of trying to scale down. So, let me update you on a little thing. Let me take these off. These are my husband's. They're dope. I thought I'd wear them. Woo -woo. But I'll take them off. Anyways, let me let you know what's going on. So, you guys haven't been seeing me do videos and tutorials and all that good stuff because in 2.5 months, we are moving. We're going to move from Texas and go to Georgia. So, I've been trying to downscale, get things ready to move because moving from state to state, that's a big deal. Like, it is quite a bit. So we're moving and I haven't been trying to shop and haul as much and I've been getting so many overwhelming comments and um, messages like, hey, I want to see a haul. Hey, where you been? I haven't saw you in a while. So that is one reason that you haven't saw me because we're moving and I haven't been trying to shop even though it's been very hard and I've still been shopping but I've been trying to like scale back. Because I'm trying to get rid of things and shopping and getting rid of things that just just not working. But let me show you the things I've been collecting over the last few months. So if you want to stay tuned, I'll show you what I've been getting. Okay, so the first store, of course, I'm going to start with is Forever 21. And I really haven't been there too often. Oh, and another thing. So a week, week and a half ago or so, I've went to New York and I went there for Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday and I came back Monday. So I was in New York for like five days, four days, five days, something like that. Had a blast. Went up there with my um, girlfriend from Germany. She turned 30. Woo woo, shout out. So we all met in New York. We had a good time. And so some of these items, I don't know what I got from there and what I got down in Austin. But um, I'm just saying, I don't know. And a lot of these things were actually getting put up. And I have to remember to pull them out. So, of course, so this is a collective haul from over a couple of weeks, whatever. And I'm not quite sure um, what I got from where. And this is not everything. This is just what I can remember. But let's start out. I do know for sure that this thing came from New York. I thought that this was so flipping cute. And I actually wore it when I was up in New York. It's a, um, like, oversized, off-the-sleeve type, what do you call this? Um, little cotton type shirt it's really cute awards I love the colors it has lions faces and eyes all throughout this little thing so I love that a pair of denim shorts that fits really well I don't like short shorts because I have fat thighs so I have to have shorts that's kind of long or wear like some stretch pants under them oh I did get quite a bit of little like biking short looking thing they're not here they already put up but I love those kind of shorts but anyway, these are a good length and they're denim. I don't know. Um, they've been bought up. Some of this stuff was already either um, worn or need to get put up. So that's these. I think I've worn these. These need to be washed. But I got those anyways. This is a skirt. I haven't worn this yet. Um, I flipping love this print. When I saw H&M had this dress, um, I wanted it. I don't know why I didn't get it when I was in St. Louis. So St. Louis has an H&M, but Texas only has an H&M up in Dallas. But anywho, I love this print. My toes are actually this print. And I got the print from Walmart, the Sally Hansen, like, um, uh, whatever. Use the little stick-on thing. So I love this. So, yes, you should guys check it out. That skirt, I picked up these shorts I love 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 these shorts these are also a good length they show just a tad bit of skin it's not too much because the pockets are right here so you'll see stuff a little bit but these are hot to death I wore these um, not too long ago and I'll show you the shoes I wore with them dope okay 
This lime green skirt, not quite sure. I think I got this down in Austin. Have yet to wear it. And I think I might even have shown this in my other haul, but it never got worn. So I didn't know if I already bought it then or whatever. It's just a lime green skirt that's like ripped. It puts me in the mind of um, a BCBG skirt that I own. But it was really cute. And this skirt was $9.80. Can't beat that. The high low skirts you know are in. I wore this. This is definitely a cute skirt right here. And it is. Um, this is the front. You see it's short. I don't know if you can see it. But it's short here. And it's long in the back. So you know these type of skirts are in. Well, you can see through it. The short part so it's really cute i wore it uh last week i think i don't know i'm not quite sure how i'm gonna i think i'll hand wash this skirt because i don't want it to get damaged in the uh wash machine but really cute it's, uh, it's like overlap layered each other i don't know this little thing reminds me of like a bath towel so the day is like you going to the pool or it's raining, just it's like a poncho. So you just put it on and go. I love the material. And I think this was on that right now, if Forever 21 is doing that buy one, get one free. And I think this is one of the items, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, because it got the little red sticker thing. So if you buy something, get something free picked up these shorts they got like paint splatter on them love them paint splatter all throughout the back and they got the um the what do you call this like ruffle things at the bottom i don't know love those i do know that i picked up this skirt in new york because i think barbie pink is dope it's hot you know what i mean this bright barbie pink skirt it is awesome. It reminds me of a lipstick. I can actually pull this off and wear it as a halter top, but nope, I'm gonna pull it off and wear it as a skirt, which is meant to be worn as. You know what I mean? So I gotta put a fit together. And if I figure out what I wear with it, I will definitely show you guys. But this skirt, and this one of them little cheap body kind of skirts, it was $7.80. Actually, this is, yeah, I guess that's what they usually are. I thought they were like $5, but here you go more stuff this little shirt got the little bat type of wing um, arms that like straight sewn down I don't know I know I have a white one too I don't know where it's at but here you go it's kind of um wide like oversized so this would be cute with like a bodycon skirt throw this little shirt on and some sandals and it's a little bit see through like you can see through it a little bit but hey leave a little to the imagination this is another um what do you call that kind of skirts high low skirts or whatever but this one is on the side so you see that angle so it's shorter over here and you get long on this side flipping awesome I saw this. I just got this recently. Um, and I tried it on and the fit is awesome. I have to find the right. Maybe I just put this on with like a wife beater in this skirt. Because the skirt is already a statement piece. Keep it simple at the top. And some, some cute little flat gold sandals probably. You in there. Um, this little shirt um, also I think came from New York. I think. I don't know. But I like animal prints and it's rainbow multicolor. Oh, to die for, okay? And it's also like an off the shoulder type shirt. So I love that. This is a halter dress. This is also a newer purchase right here. It's a very long um, halter and it like fits awesome around the boobies. 
so love it and it's really long long cotton this was 16.90 still got the tag on it so love this and the color is awesome love that color i picked these up these little things in new york at forever 21 as well they had four colors i think total and this is the pink one i was gonna get the gold one but i went with the pink one so really cute and they're okay they um they're they're for the price they're comfortable enough to get away with um wearing them you know pick up this i think this came from austin i haven't worn it it's just a black and white striped bodycon dress cute put this on with like a denim jacket some shoes you out the door with a cute little outfit this is also one of them um buy one get one free items got it because it was free okay but it really fits nice it really is something just to throw on it's um a one piece and it's shorts at the bottom the length of the um the shorts are perfect so this is a nice comfortable outfit to throw on and these little white beaters I got were also buy one get one free. They were marked down to $1.99. And so I got two navy ones. And I'm glad I got them because um, I'll show you the shoes that I just got. Okay, and I picked up these hot pink neon Air Max. I flipping love these shoes. Okay, I've been wearing the mess out of them. They are dope. They are neon. They're comfortable, they're in, I love it. And let me show you my them J's. I had to get these. These came out uh, yesterday on the 23rd. Sold out, of course. These are dope, man. So these are Jordan 12s. Flipping awesome, they're navy. I didn't get the black ones. So I had to get the navy. I got my boys the black ones and they got the gray ones. The like ones that just came out last month or whatever. But I got the navy. Me, my husband, my boys got the navy ones. Okay, let me show you this. Prada candy is awesome. Okay, this is awesome. This came from Saks or Neiman's is an exclusive only to that store. I don't know which store, but it came from there. And um, I got this stuff. This little um, is a travel size. It's already in my purse. And uh, as you see, I've been using it to death. This stuff is amazing. I love it. And also with it, I got this box, which says Prada right here. And inside of it, it has a whole bunch of free samples. And it also gave me a Prada um, makeup bag, which is in the room. And it's navy satin. It's awesome. Not only did I get those two things, and I got this. It has more samples, a card. So I got quite a bit of things with my purchase. And this also i picked up some more what do you call this paper um refillable for my planner for my agenda i picked up the paper and it's just it has like maps and all of this it was quite a bit it was a pretty penny for some paper but it give you the little brown, give you stickers, and more stickers, and it's, it's a Louis Vuitton right there. So it's a planner. It's a daytime planner. I don't know if it'll show with the lighting, but it's just a daytime planner. And I think the paper was like seventy dollars or something like that. Some crazy, ridiculous price. That suckers like me pay for and the paper comes in the paper comes in this little um like brown box or whatever and i also got my speedy 35 azure 
it is a flipping hassle because it gets so dirty i haven't really been carrying it um i've been making myself carry it now because hell you spend all this money myself carry it it's gonna get dirty so this speedy azure it's a 35 i was gonna get the 30 they didn't have it in stock and i, I i'm a fan of the 30 so i just took to the 30 which is the perfect size so i love that and i have one more where's my south beaches and i also have the sought out lebrons that everybody was going crazy over that sold out like the jordan so i have two two hot to death ass shoes that i love that i've been rocking to death I wore these up in New York and I got a lot of people like, oh my gosh, you got them. I know for the men's sizes, they were going for $4.50. Not only do me and my boys and my husband have these, but me and my daughter have hers. Of course, the little girls, they don't have the bubble. So, yes, we got to stay fly around here. But anyways, I'm done with shopping because I'm ready to move and we having all this excess. It's not going to happen. So... I don't know if I'll be doing another haul until we get moved and settled in. Then I'll probably even do a house tour or whatever to show you our new setup or whatever. But that's down the road. That's a few months away. But until now, for now, um, they're going to come pick up our stuff. And that process is going to begin very, very shortly. So, we're moving. Yay! I'm so excited because I'm ready to get the flip out of Texas. Um, that is about it. Of course, I probably got things here and there, and I'm always buying for my kids and my husband. So, it's quite a bit of things here, but I'm really got to, I really, really have to stop and just, just come to a halt until we get settled and moved. So, until then, I know you guys have been asking me, and then I know I got a comment about, um, I had that bob in, that I did the invisible port. Somebody asked me to do it. Well, by the time I got that, I already had changed my hairdo. Like this weave is a sew in. I'm about to take this out, and I don't know where my next style gonna be. Probably go back to my infamous ponytail because I love ponytails when it's hot. I don't know. I'm rambling on, so I will catch you guys in the next video. And I think my next video is gonna be the five minute challenge to do the makeup. That's gonna be really, really tough and hard for me. I don't know why because it takes. I don't even. I don't know. I don't know. Stay tuned for that video. So the five minute challenge should should be my next video. Cross my fingers that I get to it. Thank you guys for watching me and I will catch you very soon in the next video. Stay peaceful guys. Bye. And it's one more thing that I want to show you which is this Louis Vuitton umbrella. So I this was a definitely a splurge like out the blue type vibe i saw it i wanted it then i was like eh, i don't want it i shouldn't spend that much on the umbrella i started second guessing myself so i was going to exchange it but then i was like well if i exchange i want to be um sorry for that we're going to be spending so much money whatever so in it, at the end of the day i am just keeping um the umbrella and it comes with a little case over it it has Louis Vuitton imprinted embossed on the handle. It has the LV right here. Also, it has the um, Louis Vuitton here on the the gold buckle. The handle um, has Louis Vuitton right there. So yes. Your chick has a Louis Vuitton umbrella for what reason? No one really needs a Louis Vuitton umbrella, okay? <sighs> I'm not gonna even tell y'all that this umbrella was $535. We're not gonna even discuss that. But, let it rain. And I really haven't had, uh, and that's what the print looks like. Okay? So, I thought I will share that with you guys. And so, I will see you next time. Bye, guys.